بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم Excellences Distinguished Guests Ladies and Gentlemen It's a great pleasure for me and my delegation to be part of this historical summit here in Djibouti Let me take this opportunity to thank my older brother His Excellency Ismail Amargele for the warm welcome and hospitality accorded to me and my delegation it's an extraordinary honor for me and surely for all Somalis that we are here today to convene our historic talks on Somali's future here in Djibouti following our last meeting in Al-Sawawa with my brother Musa Bihe. The Somali government and its people also express true and sincere gratitude to the Prime Minister of Ethiopia my brother, His Excellency Dr. Abiy Ahmed, who organized and arranged for me our first meeting with my brother Musa Bihi in Ad Sawaba. We thank you, Dr. Abiy, for your support and commitment on resuming the talks between the two parties. Let me also extend my gratitude to the most senior diplomat, the United States Ambassador to Somalia, his Excellency Donald Yamamoto for his role and commitment to ensure these historical talks to take place here in Djibouti. He really worked hard day in and day out to make sure that this conference finally come to fruition. I would also like to recognize the contributions of all other members here. Indeed, we are here today to open a long-awaited historical talk between federal government of Somalia and Somaliland government to renew our commitment for open and honest dialogue on future relations to achieve long-lasting peace and prosperity for our society. Federal government of Somalia is committed to address all outstanding issues and bridge the gap between the two sides. It was 20 years ago today when the historic Arta conference was held here in Djibouti following 10 years of civil war in Somalia and several unsuccessful reconciliation processes took place, took place in the region. Thanks to the leadership of His Excellency Ismail Umargele who finally succeeded to host the Somali Reconciliation Conference in 2000, which paved the way the formation of new Somali government. Now, again, we are here, and we thank you, my brother Gele, for hosting similar dialogue after 20 years, which we are all grateful for, and it is indeed another historic epic in the making, which requires us to have the necessary courage and determination to take advantage of your tireless effort to help us. And yet, my brother Bih and I are here to make very tough de decisions so that our people will have a better and future and, and prosperous future. I thank you.